Today, we have for you something we think is pretty special. It's a 1994 Mercedes-Benz S600. Yes, it's the V12 S-Class. All the S600s came in a long wheelbase. This car is diamond blue with light grey leather interior, which is a very nice colour combination. For some reason, a lot of the diamond blue S-Class Mercedes came with black and blue interiors, so we're quite happy when we saw that this one had the very nice light grey. These were seriously expensive cars when they were new, well over $300,000. This car has only travelled 128,000 kilometres, and it's an Australian delivery. They're genuine kilometres. For some reason, a lot of these V12 saloons have done in excess of 300,000 kilometres. It's got the very reliable four-speed gearbox. Obviously, it's got a CD stacker, as they all did. It's got cruise control. It's got traction control. One of the first cars in the world to have traction control, I believe. It's got electric rear headrest, which you can put up and down from the touch of a button in the front here. It's got a pollen filter. There's your traction control button. You can even press this button with a shock absorber to stiffen the suspension for better cornering. These W140 Mercedes-Benz, at the time, we were told nearly sent Mercedes-Benz broke because they put so much money into developing them. The W140 series came out in 1992 and they made it right up until the very late 90s. They're also one of the first cars as well to have soft closed doors, which works perfectly on this car. Being a long wheelbase, as you can see, it's got a huge amount of leg room in the back. You've actually got an electric rear seat as well. The rear door is significantly bigger than the short wheelbase or the standard S-Class. Yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. I've been looking for a, a Mercedes-Benz V12. This is the one to buy. We think it's absolutely lovely. It's been very well cared for. It will be going to our Mercedes-Benz specialist for a check over. The other, this was also one of the first cars in the world. Before they had reverse parking sensors, you had these little circles here. When you put in reverse, it comes up about this high. So when you look in the rear vision mirror, you can see where the back of the car is. These cars are about 5.4 meters long. Press a button. You can lift the back there. It's got the spare wheel. It's got all the tools. Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous. The body is free from any damage. Some very, very minor surface scratches which will come off with a nice buff. The wheels are in good condition. The tyres. Wow, look at the size of these A-pillars. Absolutely incredible. And this is what we all like. The V12 badge. The V12 sounds absolutely fantastic and has a huge amount of power for a car that weighs more than two tonnes. So we are very proud to offer you here at the Old Timer Centre this vehicle. We think it's an excellent example. The 600 also came with the wood grain down here and the wood grain around the gear shift. Some people have put it on just because it looks a lot better on their 320 and 500 models. These are also available in a 420 V8. So there's some receipts there. It's got the original logbook. There's quite a few different books and things with this. It's even got the original tape. So here's the maintenance book. So it was delivered here in Sydney from New. And yeah, it's got a pretty good history to it as well. So I've been looking for a W140, especially if you've been looking for a Mercedes. We think you should definitely come and look at this one, take it for a drive, you're not going to be disappointed. These are very, very rare cars. Very few people had more than $300,000 in the very early 90s to buy a motor vehicle. 
another thing these came with, and you can tell because some people just put 600 badges on their 500s, is they came with these windscreen wipers on the headlights. So today we think we have for you quite possibly the best V12 W140 Mercedes-Benz at the present time in the country. So please give us a call, any inspection welcome, and we certainly look forward to hearing from you. We are the Old Timer Centre, we're located in Marrickville, we certainly